Thanks, Tara. This Christmas Eve is filled with heartbreak for the family of 16-year-old Paige Stalker. Police are still searching for the man who shot into a car filled with teenagers, ultimately killing Paige. Her family says one thing is for sure, they do not want this violence, the violence that took her life to overshadow who she was as a person. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell has their story. 16-year-old Paige Stalker's grandparents shared with me this picture. They asked me to tell you that Paige dreamed of being a doctor, volunteered at Beaumont Hospital every week, and visited them several times a week. She would study at their home or do chores for her grandma, who had a shoulder injury. They were proud of how hard she worked babysitting for kids all over the neighborhood. She's just a part of us. She's part of, she's just a part of us. And I'm unbelievably grateful that our family had a chance to have that beautiful person with us for as long as we did. Jennifer says Paige was not just a babysitter for her two kids. She became part of the family. A memory of sitting here last year, this very day, doing Christmas presents with her. She bought each individual child their ornaments. Because of the violence that happened Monday here on Detroit's east side, this Christmas Eve is not the same. Three of Paige's teenage friends are recovering from gunshot wounds while Paige's family plans her funeral. For people who know Paige, it's hard to hear people ask why she and her friends were in Detroit at 9.30 Monday night. Police say they may have picked up a friend before the shooter tried to rob them. This makeshift memorial that reads, Paige, we love you, stands along Charlevoix at the site where a gunman walked up and shot into the car filled with teens. People who know Paige say her legacy won't be the violence that took her life, but the love that she gave. But she was, was an extraordinary woman, would have been an incredible person, one of them, a wonderful doctor. But she, um, God has bigger plans for her. God has bigger plans for her, and I know she'll fulfill them. Kim Russell, 7 Action News. Wow.